KFNN. Headline News Update. Good morning, folks. This is Steve Rhodes coming to you live from the shores of Delray Beach, Florida. This is your 11 a.m. update, and currently have all the U.S. indices trading to the upside, the exception being the Dow Transports. They're off 30 points. You've got the Dow uh, Jones indice up 337, a low of 1%. Nine tenths for the S&P, or 35 points. One and a half percent for the NASDAQ 100, 167 points there. Uh, less than 1% for the Russell, that's 15 points to the upside. Now the semis, they're on fire, they're up 3.5%. Trade up 80 bucks at 23.17. Gold is up $15, silver's up 57 cents, that's a 3% move to the upside. Light Sweet Crude is up a buck 62, she's trade out at 86.13. Natural gas off two pennies, still has not bottomed, and a 30 treasury down 12 ticks. She's trading out at 121.17. If we go take a look at nine panel market update chart, we begin with the ES Mini. That's in the upper left hand side. Price, oh, I'm sorry, that's the wrong, uh, I got to the wrong thing. Market update, there we go. Here's the ES Mini. That's in the upper left hand side. So price above the top of its daily profile. That suggests a move up to 38, 38.50. We'll take a look during the Trader's Edge show at the levels that price needs to close above first in order to signal that move. Now, the spot volatilities is trading lower and looks to be targeting its 50-day exponential moving average, which is at 28.39. If that's the likely outcome, then we should see the S&P continue to move higher. The NQ is taking on resistance. That's the top of its daily profile. That price point is at 11.231.75, but close above that today. By the way, we're trading at 11.300, which suggests to move up to 11,986. U.S. dollar index consolidating within, well, it's actually, it's trading above the top of its daily profile and consolidating within its weekly profile. If you take a look at gold, got all the way back down to its TD9 support level. That was uh, um, a, that, that formed on September the 26th, 1627.70 key level of support. Gold now getting back inside its daily profile. Yesterday may have just been a one-hit wonder with a trade down below. Now, gold needs to close back above 1645.50 today. We're trading above right now to suggest a further move higher. In the case of silver, we can see price made it its way down to the bottom of its daily profile and its rising trend line. Uh, right now, trading into the resistance zone. Its resistance zone, where sellers are located, is at 1891 to 1926. Light sweet crude, uh, trading into the center of its bullish structured profile. That's at 86.75. If this is more than a counter trend move, we will see price close above that. And that would then signal move to 90.94. You take a look at uh, natural gas contract. It needs a bullish reversal candle to confirm a buy the D point pattern. 30 year treasury trading out at 121.13. Looks like this wants to continue to head lower. Folks, stay tuned for the Trader Z Show. But if you have to start your Thursday, please have a terrific one. And we'll look forward to seeing you again soon. Take care now.